Good morning, February 28th. There are just so many places in shed country that doesn't even have any snow that I, I just, I just wanna hike. See what nature has to offer. It's a new area for me. So, looking forward to getting some air in my lungs and seeing it. Seen some new country. Heck yeah. 20 minutes into my hike. Look at that third right there. Let's go check it out. that just a solid antler I like it when they get mature the fourth has always got mass to it these creatures are awesome heck yeah just a solid antler right there not a super long main beam Nice bull right there. Hard white, it looks good. Man, I'm blessed. Round you up. Man, I forgot my 360 hat. I'm probably gonna burn. Well, I did a quick walkabout lateral because I'm still going uphill, so I'm gonna pick this up, go uphill. Hopefully, we can find the match always, right? I don't think I'm going to come down this way, so I'll just haul it up here. Six. Man, I, I didn't, I don't know where I found this one. It was, it was just perfect. Must be shit hunting really heavy. I'm just trying to go up over the top of the roots to get to another spot. Didn't expect to find anything up here. <laughs> Cause I'm just bushwhacking it, but heck yeah. That's probably hard white though. Gotta love it, baby. The Lord's good to us. I saw that shed bowl clear across the canyon, so I came up here and found where it was at. Come on, this track's not tracking it backwards. So we'll see what happens. Heck yeah! There's another one. That's a nice shed right there. It's a nice six point, hard white. 
Oh yeah. Loving the grind. Appreciate my mother in heaven. Sun's just about down. I got a long ways to go to get out of here, but I'm still in a really good country, so there's a good chance I can see another one to four to seven. So we'll see. Love it when new country pans out. Snowshoot up this slope so I can glass this right here. And uh, I've seen six bulls. So. Good morning, it's March 4th. The last time I was in here, this was all bare ground. So now I got like three inches of snow. I'm gonna hike up on some of these high peaks and glass. Looking for deer and elk. Well, right after I got done doing my openings video then I saw these bulls right here it looks like there's three of them so that's a five by five and the other two are bedded the other one's a little six well just one broken antler looks like he shed one antler so heck yeah three bulls that bull was rubbing its broken antler on that tri tree like it was trying to get it to come off. No, I just didn't catch it. I was trying to catch it. Maybe it'll do it again. There's two shed bulls. They're just down from those other three. And there's a I can see an antler through my spotter. I am. Uh, I'll just keep going and give those some, some time to clear out. It's kind of low. But. Don't want to disturb those right now. Let's leave them. That's five bulls, to, two shed bulls, one missing an antler. Wild country. Appreciate it. Well, update. The two shed bulls are about 150 yards from the shed, going up the canyon, and then the one with the broke antler with the one side shed is about what, 100 yards up from the other two. They're still bedded. 
They both got their antlers a five and a six. Just chilling. I'm gonna pop over this ridge right here where I can't see him anymore. But I just kind of wanted to know a final update. Those ones, the ones that are going up in the shed are still standing, so hopefully they'll keep going. But I'll pop, pop back and check on them this afternoon, but I'm gonna go up higher and look over the other side. Oh, I came up over the top of the stretch of glass the other side. This is a kind of a north west facing the snows super deep. So I got my snowshoes. Looks pretty good. Well, I found another ball. Both its antlers. I'll look around there for a minute. So that's six bulls. Two more bulls, so very far away. They both got their antlers. Man, this snow is melting fast. It's early in the afternoon and I I wanna get over there and Obviously, I shed the one this morning, and it'll probably just be the one because I'm not gonna, it's not worth looking around. It's too much snow. So I'm heading back down. Well, the two bulls that were laying down are about 600 yards from where they were laying down. They both have their antlers still. And I can't see any of the other ones, so. It's gonna take me probably an hour to get down. It's like two, close to three o'clock. That's exciting though. Eight elk. I did see some cows coming up in here, but eight bulls. So it was a beautiful day. Well, that's not the one I glassed up. So, I am so fortunate. And when I got up this morning and it had so much snow everywhere, I wondered about even coming. So that other one's up the hill a ways. Oh, I'm blessed. I'll pick up this one and go up, take it up to that one, see if it's a match. to be a mountain man. Heck yeah, round you up. <sighs> well, there was too much snow in their tracks and then there was fresh tracks in there. A lot of blood, but my snowshoes are so noisy that I'm just gonna spook everything out of the country. So I decided to just, after I picked these up, I, I tracked the old tracks as long as I was coming back to my vehicle. But when there was fresh tracks, they had blood too, but just, oh, I'm just gonna go glass, do the safe thing. Okay, so it's March 7th. This is just a recap of the video. So that was a new area for me, and I picked up this really nice one right here first. Couldn't match it up. Found that one up high. There's too much snow to even look for that one. And I saw that 
shed bowl. I tracked him clear down to where he, he came out of the deep snow, so I just thought, uh, I'll go back in there later. Which I definitely want to go back in there later because tracking him out, I found this little one and then that one right there too. So, and they're all, you know, a year old, so, so nobody has been in there. And I went back in there after it snowed just to glass, but I glassed up this one brown stuck in the snow. I just waited for those elk to kind of move off and went in there and picked this up. And that other one ended up being right by it. I only glassed up to one, so. I was like, that's a good area. Definitely gonna go back in there. Thanks for watching. Howdy up.